In this guide me, you will configure and use delegation profiles. The purpose of the new delegation feature is to assign to a delegate the authority to approve and review time cards, to run reports, etc., while you are out of the office. Various elements within security must be in place for the delegation to be possible. From the home page, click Setup. Mouse over Security and click User Profiles. Click User ID T70TR00. Mouse over Actions and click Edit. In the For Delegation Requests box, an email address used to notify the user about delegation request activity must be entered. All users participating in the delegation process will require an email address. In this case, the entry already exists. Click Return. A delegation profile that defines who can act as a delegate must be created. Mouse over Setup, then Security, and click Delegation Profile. Click New. In the Profile box, enter SUPV. Press Tab. In the Description box, enter Supervisor. Press Tab. Leave the Access All Users checkbox unchecked and click Save. Select users to whom delegation authority is to be given. Click to select Frank, user T70TR00FR. Click to select Jan, user t 70 tr 0 Click Save. You do not wish to create another profile. Click Return. Assign the profile to the delegator. Mouse over Setup, then Security, and click User Profiles. Click to select the user named Instructor. User code T70, T mouse over Actions and click Functions List View. In the Position 2 box, enter DELE, -E, press Tab. Click Go. The list starts with functions beginning with DELE. -E. Note that the user's Function Access Profile, FAP, provides access to the three security functions for the delegation process. Click to select Delegation Request. Click Keywords. Note the ability to allow the delegate to access pay rates. Leave the profile to use the authority granted from the FAP, which in this case is Yes. Click the Delegate Profile Selection icon. Click the SUPV Profile. Click Save. Click Home. The user is now ready to delegate authority. Only one delegate request per time period can be created thus not allowing multiple individuals to act as a delegate. Mouse over Timekeeping, then Delegation. Click Make a Request. Click New. Click the Selection icon for the Delegate box. Click to select Frank, user code T70TR00FR. Click the Start Date calendar icon. Click February 23. Click the End Date calendar icon. Click February 27. Click Save. 
an email will be generated and sent to Frank notifying him of your delegation request. Note that the status of the request is at a requested state. The screens that follow will have you act as Frank in order to accept the request. Click anywhere to continue. You are signed on as Frank. Frank has read the email advising him of your request. He can either accept or reject the request. Note that Frank's security allows access to only four employees based upon his labor level profile. Mouse over timekeeping, then delegation. Click respond to request. The request from instructor T70TR00 appears at a requested status. Click to select the delegation request. Mouse over actions and click accept. An email is generated advising instructor of Frank's acceptance. Note the status has changed to accepted. Click home. The upper right corner of the screen now displays an Act as Delegate selection. Click Act as Delegate. Double click T70TR00. Frank now has the adopted authority of Instructor. This is evident because he can now access other employees outside of the restriction imposed by his labor level profile. If Frank initially had more authority than instructor, he will be restricted to the authority given to instructor when acting as delegate, regardless of the employees or functions he is working with. Click Acting for Instructor. Frank is returned to the authority granted to him via his user profile, given that he is no longer acting as a delegate. Click Act as delegate. Double click T70TR00. As instructor, mouse over timekeeping then delegation. Click make a request. Note the status of the delegation request is that of accepted. Click home. Even while Frank is working as a delegate, instructor can still access employees as normal. Should instructor need to ask for additional time to be delegated, hovering over Actions, then Edit, will allow a change in dates to be made. No additional email is generated, nor is it required that Frank accept the altered duration. Click anywhere to continue. TR00JN. Delegated, hovering over In this Guide Me, you followed instructions to complete the following task. Configure and use delegation profiles.